While lines to get into the Fair Park mega site at times seem to go on forever, the vaccine supply certainly does not. The county received 9,000 doses this week and already faces more than 300,000 people registered and waiting. But it's who has registered so far. That is what the issue is for us. That has the attention of South Dallas advocates like Tabitha Wheeler. The issue is the registration process. Accessibility. The accessibility. Accessibility in parts of the city that skew older, lower income, and predominantly people of color. The population most at risk for the worst effects of COVID-19. Dallas County already knows the 11 zip codes most affected. You see them shaded here in light blue. County data says about 600,000 people live in these zip codes, but just under 27,000 have signed up for the vaccine. That means the access to the registration is the actual problem. And to solve it, Adam Basildua and four other Dallas City Council members this week proposed creating hubs in their districts to get more people signed up. Dallas Mayor Eric Johnson responded Wednesday in a memo asking the city manager to put a stop to it, saying it's the mayor's responsibility to make sure with limited resources, vaccine registration hubs go where they're needed most. Telling WFAA, I have tasked my designated emergency management coordinator to develop a database plan for outreach and distribution. And I appreciate those of my colleagues who have offered their thoughts and support of the city's efforts in a constructive way rather than through publicity stunts. This was most definitely not a publicity stunt. Wheeler says everyone is simply trying to find ways to help Dallas County reach those who need the vaccine most to sign up and hope that when they do, the vaccine still in short supply can catch up to those still waiting. In Dallas, I'm David Goins.